everybody uh i've been running out of time uh, getting videos in so i figured i'd grab this one here real quick i've been trying to do a couple videos when i can but i've just been so busy but this one came in uh i think four days ago uh this is a 78 let me check i'm pretty sure it's a 78 uh, now it is a 76 so a 76 plymouth fury station wagon and it is a sport suburban never heard of one it's kind of cool got some cool looking tail lights on it if you know anybody needing any tail lights uh, but this car it's got some rust in the uh, quarters uh, it has a 360 motor and I believe it's a 727 transmission Uh, but the lady who had this, uh, the story on this car, uh, she had a bunch of, uh, brush that needed to be bush hogged, uh, around her farm. And when they were bush hogging, they uncovered three barns and this was in one of the barns and she just didn't want it no more. Uh, I guess she forgot it was in there and they found it and they drug it out and she said she didn't want it So the guy who was bush hogging it brought it to us uh, He said if it had a 440 in it, he was gonna keep it, but it's got 360 so he didn't want it But that will work for me because I'll use that motor and transmission for a project I've got But I mean it's got good front end Grill needs to be cleaned up Bumper's got a dent in it. Uh, that fender's no good. That rear door is no good. It's got a crease in it. But I mean, all the glass is good. Got some good tail lights. Uh, I'll probably hang on to this car for a couple weeks. And then I'll probably just pull the drivetrain out of it and crush it. Uh, we don't really have a use for it unless someone needs any parts off of it. That's full of scrap I gotta get out. Get all that stuff out. Look like it had a uh, rear seat that would flip up. Door looks pretty solid, but it's got some big dents in it. I don't know if someone could use it. That looks like where they pushed it with a bobcat out of the trailer. It's got some cool mirrors on it. But it looks like someone was working on the ignition. Steering wheel's off. Seats are actually in pretty decent shape. It's got a little wear right here. But they're a 60-40 uh, split with a center flip in it. Showing 59,195,000. Mm -hmm. Or, so it's probably 159,195 miles. Although the pedals don't look that worn, so. But I, I doubt it's that low. Heater AC. Got your lights, your. Oh, that's cool. So you got your wipers and then you push down for your sprayers to wash your 
windshield off. You got a clock, your oil and fuel, your temp, and alternator gauge. I guess your radio is there, but it's missing. Ashtray. I don't know what that is. Oh, that's your gate ajar light. It says gate ajar, and I guess it lights up. Might be the center center wheel. That your dash is looks just about perfect. I mean I don't see any cracks in this dash. It's a nice looking dash. Got some paperwork. I don't think there's a title in here. Probably just receipts of work done to the car over the time. Yeah, it's all bank paperwork. Like it's got a little bit of rust in it. I know the back quarter has got some rust on it where the spare tire goes. It's rusted out. But if anybody needed any parts for one of these cars, uh, this one here will be here for a little while. Uh, I wonder if there's a key in it. I might be able to get this one to run, maybe. Now, lock cylinder's out, which I could probably still get it to run. I just have to uh, cross some wires and get it to run. But I don't know if I'm gonna have time to get it to see if it'll start up or not. But anyway, I uh, figured I'd get you guys another video of this one. Uh, I still have a lot more to uh, videotape. It's just been so busy lately. It's been hard getting anything done. I'm trying to get this hood down. It's got these crazy slides. Uh, I guess you're supposed to grease them and this holds your hood up But then these are supposed to slide this way and down that rack or uh, track to uh, get this hood to Come down But this thing's been sitting so long and they don't want to really move I'm trying to do this without this hood falling on me too But I also have some other old cars to uh, check out. There we go. So anyway, that's a 76 Plymouth Fury station wagon. And I also have this Buick, a Sabre. Which that will be another video. A uh, tree fell on it. So, and I did, I popped the front of the roof up on this one. But, uh, I'll do a more in-depth video on this one. I popped the roof up with a fork so I could get in it. But, uh, I'll do another video on that one. And there's the Plymouth Fury 3 I got. I already did a video on that one. I got a bunch more uh, old cars way, way in the back. But anyway, that's it for now. Uh, if you like anything you've seen, leave a comment down below. I'll try and get to it when I can. Uh, but until the next time, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.